There is uh, there's research now that tells us um, that when you lose 1% of the GDP of India, you also lose 1 million jobs. It is no secret that our GDP has fallen. It was around 7.5, it's close to 5.5 right now. That adds up to 2 million jobs in the last one year. And we don't have to rely on the statistics. Each of us who's watching this program tonight knows someone who lost their job or who's been laid off from their organization. Maybe the organization that you work for. Why is that happening? Why are people losing jobs? We also know that the country has had trouble creating jobs. The Niti Aayog, which is effectively the planning commission, has said this is underemployment and not unemployment. We've had the government put their heads together at this point in the finance ministry to try and figure out what they can do to solve the problem, acknowledging that the problem exists. What we need to do is have a conversation about it because not enough people are talking about the fact that we are in a job crisis in this country. And unless steps are taken immediately to solve this job crisis, we will have large scale unemployment. Consider the fact that the real estate industry, the textile industry, the infrastructure industry are in distress. When entire construction sites close down, what happens to the masons and the bricklayers and the daily wage laborers who are working on those construction sites? Where do they go? They get paid weekly and if they're not being paid weekly, how do they pay their rent? How do they buy food? We need to understand that it's not just in your IT office, your telecom office, your BPO office that people are losing jobs. People are also losing jobs from small scale industry, from, from the uh, the sector that is largely unofficial. Where are all of these people going to go? How are they going to feed their children? And the bigger question to then ask is with the high fuel prices, the higher price of food and fruits, and the higher price of milk, how are these people going to feed their children? Why is it that our economy is completely crumbling around us? And I want you to call in and share your personal stories and you can also do so on inball.in. But joining me on the show,